Well, that did not go as planned. My plan was to find a nice composition with rolling hills of Alpe de Suisse, which is where I am right now, and uh, have those mountains in the background. And there were some high clouds over them before, so I thought it was going to be just awesome. The sun lighting up the mountains from over there. And, uh, yeah, it was going to be great, but I made two mistakes. Mistake number one is I thought that the roads here would actually take me quite close to where I was hoping to shoot. And they do not. I had to hike for uh, about uh, 1500 feet to get here. Uh, it was a bit of a mad dash because it was already 6 p.m. when I got to the nearest place I could park. And the second thing is the location that I had scouted on Google Earth turned out to be terrible. <laughs> One issue with Google Earth is you don't realize how tall the trees are and uh, the trees here blocked the entire view so this was definitely the wrong place to be. Luckily all that didn't actually matter because all the high clouds are gone. <laughs> so I think that's it for now. I'm gonna head back to the car, have some food, and tomorrow I'm hiking up starting at 3 a.m. up to Cicada which is uh, just nearby in that direction. Um, I'm parking at the bottom of the mountain and hiking to the top at night, so that will be fun.
okay guys I don't know how much you can see probably nothing at all <laughs> so I'm about 2,000 feet from the trailhead maybe a bit more so just a few hundred to go the town is over there and you probably can't see but the weather looks nice and mystical so I think we might have something cool this morning. There it is. The footage you're seeing now was filmed after I took the image. Shortly after my arrival, I was joined by a few other photographers and I don't like to film around other people. So I will leave you with the image and some of my favorite drone footage that I've captured yet. Thank you for joining me today and I will see you very soon in part two of this adventure.